something close to my heart and uh, it's just uh, I wanted to be involved and I think as I said it's, it's, it's great seeing them now and, and you know you recognise their faces from, from uh, previous visits and, and they, they sort of get to know you so it's, it's a great bond and it's just it's great to see how happy and uh, joyful they are and it, uh, that, that, that's the motivation for me. So I think Callum said, have you ever got a red card? What? No, me? <laughs> yeah, they, they've got disabilities, but to, to see the way they, they, they crack on with things and how happy they are, it's, it's a real, it's, a, it's, it's, it's satisfying to see and it's, it's, it's great to be a part of. And, um, you know, they've, they've, they've obviously got difficulties and um, anything that I can do to to, to make their day or just to answer a few of their questions so I'm, I'm, uh, you know, I'm happy to be a part of that. From my point of view that's probably where the most inspirational figures we need working with kids with disabilities because like I said before they want to play football they see it on TV to them but they just want to play football like everyone else and we've got different pathways and that, that could lead them to play to England and um, because we're like an English ID, um, ID centre so you know if they've got those kind of aspirations who best to meet someone like Paul it's good it's good to come see them and I, I think it makes them happy hopefully they're happy to see me I don't know but uh... You know, it's good. It's good to do to do me bit. Who's your best player on your team? On my team, uh, me. <laughs> <laughs> it gives. It definitely gives them a boost. You, you know, when you when you turn up, there are always you know smiles on their faces, and, and they're 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 really happy to see you. Yeah, it's. I mean, for the kids' sake, it's fantastic as well. Someone like Paul, who not just comes along but pays attention to him, talks to him, and gets involved. That's what they're after, and you see them today, their faces when he walked in, and the selfies and the pictures they want. It helps them massively because just because these kids have got you know special education needs, they still want to be footballers, they still want to play football, they still want to do what everyone else is doing. So someone like Paul, when he comes up and talks to them, you know, it makes their day, it makes their years. Having a player involvement like Paul involved is, is huge for us. Are there any memorable visits from the last year that really stand out? Uh, I think the the Reading Awards was I think it was end of the year awards uh, for the the students' progress. That was that was unbelievable. That was I didn't want it to finish in the end because there was you know there was live, live performances. There was you know great singers and uh, the, it was just it was it was good fun because they they're receiving awards and they're 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 really happy and just just. It's just great to great to see smiles on our faces. I do have a have a cousin who is who has um, special needs, and uh, I just uh, I thought it'd be you know something to to get involved in, and I, I would have a I would have a passion for it. I like to I like to talk to the students. I like to get involved and um, just try and just try and help them as much as as much as I can. As if that's just turning up and watching them play, then you know so be it. But it's it's, it's great to see to see uh, the students and they're you know very welcoming and, and they're very very loving and it's um, you know I, I love being a part of it. Yeah I've, I've joined in sometimes uh, in a indoor a few indoor sessions and uh, just, just just getting involved so sort of standing around on the outside I think the, the kids sort of appreciate that as well when you when you get involved with them.